Hello, my name is Amelia Engstrom. I thought it would be interesting to portray a young man in 1930s Chicago. His name is Guy Gisborne. I made up the story as I went along, trying to keep it as accurate as possible. I chose prompts based on what I thought would line up with the timeline and be easy to talk about. I faced many challenges, but never truly overcame them. I just simply survived. My favorite journal is my last. The day is September 4th, 1939. Journal Entry 10. We've received some terrible news from our government. Three days ago, Germany invaded Poland. Yesterday, France and England declare war against Germany. We believe this is the beginning of a second world war. We are unsure to what extent this shall affect us. I'm caught. I want to help our overseas allies fight, but I wouldn't want to risk dragging this country into another brutal war. I can only imagine the consternation facing this president in this time. Desperation has overwhelmed the United States over the last decade. A war would be the last possible thing that could help us. If we are called upon to join the war, I will enlist in the war effort and fight for my country. However, I cannot deny that I pray that it won't come to that. I wish to live into my late years, but I am prepared to lay down my life in this war should our government join it. I pray that the path chosen in this battle, the outcome be beneficial in the end. The only thing keeping me going is something I was told by my mother as a boy. I was very sick and almost didn't make it. I can't imagine how she stayed so strong. I was a frightened child and thought I was going to die, but she told me that I wouldn't die because it wasn't my time. I didn't understand it then, but years later I asked her about it, and she told me, when it's not your time, nothing can kill you, and when it is your time, it doesn't take much. I thought of this all throughout the hardships of the last decade, and it's how I've known that I will survive even the darkest times. So, if war comes, so be it. I'm not afraid, and I will fight.